Ali from Merlin Mosaica here. I'm just going to go through a quick look at the Beetle Bits Mini and using it to cut a glass sheet. Hi, it's Ali from Merlin Mosaica here. I just want to show you the setup I use to cut um, 200 squares of glass. Uh, at the moment, I'm cutting Wismatch iridized. So I just cut across like that. Get my runners. And snip. and then just put that in again up to my stop. And now this is the Beetle Beats Mini system. Um, it normally the ruler is calibrated normally by default in inches. But on the back of it, it does have centimetres. Now I want to cut 200. So normally from the zero point, 200 is here, uh, but I just wanted the bit of extra. So what I've done is moved it to negative five, which is here, as you can see. So there's five through to zero and then another 15. That gives me my 20. Um, so I'm just going to cut, when I cut my glass, I just cut 200 squares and then I'll go back later and readjust it so I can cut them into 100 pieces. So, so it comes with two waffle pieces. I happen to have others just set up because I was doing some other stuff, but um, that's fine. So you just slide it in until it hits the stop at the uh, size you want. And you and you break. And here you go. And you put it in and you have limited space obviously. And you cut. And you remove it and you break. Now theoretically I really should be cutting this with the iridized side down but I'm not. So it's a case of do as I say, not do as I do. And this is the beautiful Wismatch um, greens that I received and they are absolutely beautiful. I will move these out of the way though, just because I should. Um, and I'll be cutting the 200 squares into two by ones when I do all these. So it's just gorgeous. In fact, that's a straighter edge there, so I will swap it around. I just think there's a bit of a crooked edge on that one, and I'd rather have that on the smaller sheet rather than the big sheet. So I'll pop that down there. And so, and break. How easy is that? Thanks for watching. If you liked, don't forget to hit the like button down below. If you want to hear more, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. See you next time.